who was a member of parliament for 47 years between 1950 and 2001 and a cabinet minister under Harold Wilson and James Callaghan in the 1960s and 1970s. Ben inherited a hereditary peerage on his father's death, preventing him continuing as an MP. He fought to remain in the House of Commons, and then campaigned for the ability to renounce the title, a campaign which succeeded with the Peerage Act 1963. In the Labour government of 1964-70 he served first as Postmaster General, where he oversaw the opening of the Post Office Tower, and later as a technocratic Minister of Technology. In 1971-72, when the Labour Party was in opposition, he was chairman of the Labour Party. In the Labour government of 1974-1979, he returned to the cabinet, initially as Secretary of State for Industry, before being made Secretary of State for Energy, retaining his post when James Callaghan replaced Wilson as Prime Minister. When the Labour Party was in opposition in the 1980s, he was a prominent figure on its left wing and the term Ben Knight came to be used for someone with radical left wing politics. Ben was described as one of the few UK politicians to have become more left wing after holding ministerial office. After leaving Parliament, Ben was president of the Stop the War Coalition from 2001 until his death. Biography Early Life and Family Ben was born in London on the 3rd of April 1925. Ben's father William Wedgwood Ben was a Liberal Member of Parliament from 1906 who crossed the floor to the Labour Party in 1928 and was appointed Secretary of State for India by Ramsay MacDonald in 1929, a position he held until 1931. William Ben was elevated to the House of Lords with the title of Viscount Stansgate in 1942. The new wartime coalition government was short of working Labour peers in the upper house. From 1945 to 46, William Ben was the Secretary of State for Air in the first majority Labour government. Ben's mother, Margaret Wedgwood Ben, was a theologian, feminist and the founder president of the Congregational Federation. She was a member of the League of the Church Militant, which was the predecessor of the movement for the ordination of women. In 1925, she was rebuked by Randall Davidson, the Archbishop of Canterbury, for advocating the ordination of women. His mother's theology had a profound influence on Ben, as she taught him that the stories in the Bible were based around the struggle between the prophets and the kings and that he ought in his life to support the prophets over the kings who had power, as the prophets taught righteousness.